I already used the heal. I'm off to a shit start. And, and we're, we're back. back. Alright, let's take a peek at what I got here. Okay, so this is the one I, I need to draw. Okay, we're good. Just forget it. I just forgot the way my guns were arranged and I fucking drew the wrong ass gun. Dang. Yeah, that cost me a friggin' heal. But what, I got like 70 something more I just said, so we should be alright. Use the dang bolt cutters, which. Bolt cutters seem like a useful tool. Like, why would you only use that once and discard it? Like, wouldn't you just hold on to those? I mean, if anything, it could be a throwaway weapon. You could beat the shit out of somebody with a bolt cutter. Uh-huh. Exactly. I mean, listen, I understand that it's supposed to be, like, you know. Uh -huh. Creepy that he, like. Dragged the body, but, like. Nothing. Oh, he did that way too quick for how slow it was at first. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like well, you ran in. Place in a mine in case he tries to sneak up on me. <sighs> Scary thing that doesn't even mean anything. Run up here, grab these bullets. Okay, cool. So he he was invulnerable, he was just kinda there to scare you. See, walked right into my fucking mind. I blocked you, son of a bitch. And she's got wider blast radius, which is good against them up close. Over. These fucking enemies are just. Also, how do you move that with this? Hand? Like, stop using that hand to push things. Like, mm -hmm. use your shoulder or something. Damn. Survivors? Wait, who was the walk It was It was playing on the, um, what is it? The, uh, radio that I was just by. Oh, okay. Oh, no, we're gonna equip this guy. Basically, keep my. If you hear explosion, if we hear explosions, it means they're behind me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Could just keep up the strat for a while. Oh boy! Oh, look, you can survive a mine. There's no way to them. I could lay a mine here. That way, if anyone gets too close, it'll automatically self-destruct. I'll just try this. This is a new strat. This isn't a strat I've ever seen anyone else do. So it's probably not going to work. Can you get killed by your own mine? No. Here comes another one. Okay. This is tense. It's been a while since I felt tense in this game. Oh, 
Oh my god, you see how he charged me? The goddamn bullet sponge, he's just tanking all those fucking shots from the shotgun blast. One thing that's scary is just the camera, the way it clips. I think you're seeing parts of Ethan's body. And it's, um... I'm mistaking it for an enemy. One way they balance out Village of Shadows, at least, is, um... Enemies drop a lot of gold. Or lay. As it is in this game. Exactly, for the merchant, so that's, that's how they balance it out. Isn't the merchant the bad dude this time? Yep, the duke. Yeah, you see like how it all... Yeah, the noise we hear right now, there's a big dude with an axe out there. Or a hammer. And he's supposed to be like this guy you're supposed to try and avoid because it's really hard to kill him. On your first game. Yeah, New Game Plus, he's simple as hell to kill, you know what I mean? No, no big thing at all. But, I'm, n I'm just not going out there because there's... You know, it's open ground, there's more enemies out there. I, you know, at least with this, I got my back to the wall. They gotta come to me. Yeah. And basically, it's a... It's a, it's a time sequence. You just, um, run out the clock. Then a cutscene will play. And we'll be on with the rest of the game. Can you pick up your mind? Yes. So any unused mines I can pick right back up. One one strat I used last time when I played on hardcore is apparently you can't be injured when you're climbing a ladder. So I would start climbing the ladder and then I'd get in the middle of it and then I would just stop moving and I'd just wait there. <laughs> and enemies couldn't get me. But it felt like I was waiting there longer than usual. Like, I felt like the game's not going to progress unless I, um... Leave? Yeah, that's what it felt like with that. No one else is coming, right? Yeah, doesn't look like it. So maybe you have to go up? Yeah, maybe it's time I progress. Alright. Pick up my mind. Pick up my mind. Are you going to go up? Yeah, let's go up the ladder. Crazy? Like, can't you just run out the other way, or... No, see? This is the cutscene. Cut yeah. Oh, so, so you do get killed by this guy. There's no... Yeah, this guy grabs avoiding you. That. Yeah. Gotcha. Also, the only time they're on horses, like... You know... use that hammer for anyway. He's the best uh, railroad maker ever. Remember I was scared when I first time I played this game and I got uh you know this cutscene happened. I didn't know it's like I didn't do there's no there's no avoiding that. You even got that shrill like gamer voice. Well because what it is is um Perfect. In Resident Evil 5, there's a, there's a special cutscene that'll play if you get killed, and I didn't know if that's what was happening to me. He gets his fingers back, right? We'll find out. Perhaps next time? Soon. We got 30 seconds. Okay. Well, do you want him to get his fingers back? I mean, yes. That's very kind of you. You don't even know this guy, and you wish him all his fingers. I mean... Isn't that a normal thing to isn't wish? Isn't isn't a Christmas song? I mean, you don't normally like think that in your head, you know, ever. Isn't that a Christmas song? We wish you all your fingers. We wish yep. you all your fingers. Yeah. 
So what I'm doing right now is I'm just looting this area right now because after you go through that door... Alright, and that is the end of the episode. Alright, tune in next time, babies. Bye. Bye-bye.